Yes. Uh, so first off, I would like to invite Minister Rania. Uh, Egypt has just hosted COP27, uh, which is also known as the COP of Implementation. And in fact, one word that I learned from this conference uh, was the concept of noifi, fulfilling pledges. So Minister, uh, could you tell us more about how Gaia can actually support noifi, the concept of translating commitments and pledges to tangible action and impact? Well, thank you very much, and uh, let me uh, thank the World Economic Forum uh, for this initiative. Um, moving from pledges to implementation requires uh, unlocking a lot of the commitments, uh, be it from uh, advanced economies, private sector that wants to come in. Uh, and here, uh, philanthropic capital, uh, and I may be uh, in, a, in a session at uh, COP27, it was about missing P, which I said it's the prominent P. There's a big role uh, for philanthropy to come in, uh, to help uh, with uh, the uh, climate action in different countries, to partner, uh, be it with the government, uh, to actually help uh, also on the technical advisory, uh, on the preparation of projects and so forth. So there is uh, a very important role uh, for philanthropy to unlock uh, or give a good uh, investment case for philanthropy. We've seen uh, in the morning that uh, only 2% goes to climate action. Today it's very difficult uh, to have a development project that doesn't have climate at its heart. Uh, I believe that uh, the work that is being done on the social side with, ag with farmers, with gender and so forth um, is also uh, uh, could be considered climate action. Uh, so we need to, I'm very excited about this initiative, looking forward uh, to showing how uh, uh, governments can provide uh, more insight into what they're doing, uh, their uh, plans also with the MDBs. There's an ongoing discussion on reforms there, and there is a role for uh, philanthropy to play uh, to also uh, provide uh, more, um, uh, uh, you know, catalyst, catalytic capital to actually move from the pledges to implementation. This is the how. So congratulations to the WEF for, for this initiative. I'm very happy to be part of it. Thank you, Rania.